New guys on the block, Candido Collective coming in with the goods. I saw this band online being spoken about quite a lot a few months back when I bought this. Um, they look cool, they look like they're showing good alternatives for film, colour film in a modern day, which is great. I bought two of their 200 ISO stock for $6.99 directly off their website with 24 exposures. Now, on doing my research now, they no longer do 24 exposures. They're all 36 and they're priced at $8.99 now for this stock. Don't have any preference for 24 or 36 exposures. Me personally, I like a 24 exposure because they fit perfectly into the YouTube version of my YouTube videos. Whereas 36 exposures, sometimes I'm cutting out photos that I don't necessarily want to cut out just to try and make the video shorter. Personal preference. Now, I threw my roll of Candido straight into my Pentax K1000 and I believe it was the sunniest day in England when I chose to shoot this. And I was accompanied by Exploring Analog. That's my cat. And I was accompanied by Exploring Analog who was... Are you all right? You all right? Yeah? What? Right, where was I? Exploring Analog was visiting at the time and we went and chose a couple of local spots in the Lake District just to go and explore. I've been doing a little bit of Googling on Candido Collective. There seems to be quite a lot of speculation online about what film stock Candido is. And people are actually quite mean. Is it Kodak Vision? Is it Fuji? Quite frankly, I don't give a f I'm sure if you contacted Candido directly, they would give you more information on it rather than just be complete Me, personally, I'm just really happy there is somebody out there in the film community who is going out and doing this kind of stuff, providing affordable film, whatever it may be. If you're a professional photographer, granted, if you want to go and shoot Fuji Superior, go and buy Fuji Superior. Simple. Right, that was a proper run. I'm gonna relax off of that run.
I, I, I had a lot of fun with this role. I had done zero research prior to going out shooting. I obviously knew it was a colour role. I know the ISO was 200 and I know I had 24 exposures. That area of unknown and the mystery behind that was really exciting for me. I love the results. They are all memories in my, in my head. They're all really, really good. The stock is as cool as a cucumber and those greens are green. And there's quite a bit of heavy magenta in some of my shots. So it does fit a Fuji stock, but there's quite heavy halations on the highlights. But again, I don't care. We found an alpaca farm or a llama farm. I'm not quite sure, I can't tell the difference. And uh, we went, we had to go and take some photographs. And apparently they teach these alpacas how to twerk, but this one right here wasn't really doing a good job. Now Clara did inappropriately ask one of the alpacas whether they spit or swallow. And if you head over to her video, you do get to see the conversation that they have. <laughs> The next day we went and did a quick drive by to York and again I didn't really film anything because I'm allowed to enjoy myself. So yeah, that's uh, Candido 200. I had a lot of fun with this film role. I like that they're doing 36 exposures now. More bang for your buck. It is as cool as ice. Vanilla ice. Ice, ice baby. I'm sure you have your own opinions after watching this video or from your own personal experiences. Quite frankly, I don't care. So just keep them to yourself because this is my opinion. And I liked it. It was a good film stock and I will be buying and trying out the rest of their range when I get paid. Yeah, I can't afford to shoot Portra or Cinestill, so I'm gonna stick with these companies like Candido and thank them for giving me the opportunity to try something new or something that I can't, you know, I wouldn't normally do. I really enjoyed it and they are bringing the fun back into this film community with affordable film stocks like this. I hope more people enjoy it like I have. With that, I'm just gonna go and leave you with a shot of a coffee shop and bear good halations because I love halations. Ooh wee. All right off now. Go back to watching Grainy Days or Joe Greer or something like that. Mm -hmm.